Hi, my name is Brad Regeer. I'm a customer service engineer for Textron Aviation, specializing in the Hawker 4000. Today, I'm going to show you how to use the CMC for troubleshooting the RTD system on the Hawker 4000. An RTD is a resistive temperature device or a temperature sensor. To get to the RTD pages, you will select maintenance from the upper right drop down menu on the Copilot's MFD. Then select System Diagnostics and then Chapter 26 Fire Protection and 10 Fire Protection Function. At this point, you will pick the data group that contains the RTD that you are looking for. The name of the RTD group will also match the cast message you will get if a probe in that group is bad or hot. Once you find the RTD group you are looking for, you will notice that there is a number and color dot beside each RTD. The number is the temperature that the probe is sensing. This number will not go red if the probe gets hot enough for a cast message. You will need to go to the cast logic troubleshooting manual, chapter 26, to find the temperature at which the RTD will cause the cast message to post. The dot will be green if the circuit to the probe is good and red if it is bad. Also, you will have a bleed leak detect fail cast message. This cast message means that the circuit in one of the RTDs is bad. This could also mean that the RTD resistance is out of range. One problem that is hard to solve is if a connection in, in the RTD circuit is loose and has a high resistance. A high resistance will cause the temperature indication to rise. To check for this issue, use the maintenance manual, chapter 26, adjustment and test section. You simply allow all RTDs to cool to ambient temperature and the indication should be within the tolerance specified in the manual. Another problem we have with this system is that the CMC does not record in the fault history which RTD gave you a bleed leak cast message. So if you only get the bleed leak cast in flight, you will not be able to find out which RTD is causing the cast message. The only way to find out which RTD is getting hot is to have a bus reader installed in flight when you get the cast message. A bleed leak detect fail cast message will post which RTD circuit is bad. If you have any questions, you can call us at 1-800-HAWKER-2 or email us at hawker underscore 4000 underscore support at txtav.com. Thank you for your time. Have a good day.